It's so easy. Uh, K, if you know what can do it. You're going to want to stay to the end for this one. If you're an inventor, if you have a creative idea on some type of intellectual property, or you have uh, something going, you're just an entrepreneur, period, and you need funding or you need someone to invest in you, you're going to want to watch this video to the end because I have three simple steps. Three, three. If you can't do anything else in your life, three simple steps to getting anybody, not just the Shark Tank people, the Shark Tank investors, not just them, to getting anybody to invest in you. All right. It's all about perception. And let me show you why majority of these people come on the show looking all nervous and, 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 and scared and sweating and and crying when they leave and and all that. Look how nervous they are. Look at it, it's, it's sad, okay? And the reason being is because they don't have the three steps that I'm going to give you before they go on the show. Now, matter of fact, if you have these three steps, chances are you don't even need to go on the show. You can end up being in the seat of one of the investors pretty soon in your lifetime, all right? No guarantees. <laughs> Okay, but pay attention. All right, so the reason why these guys don't have a clue how to get these people to deal with them is because they don't have the three steps. I'm going to show you me using the three steps as if I wanted um, help, as if I wanted help, as if I needed an investor or something like that. Okay, I'm going to show you exactly what I'm doing and why I would win the investors approval if I went on a show. How you can use it if you plan on going on a show or if you have meetings with investors lining up, you have a new cool app idea, website, new Netflix or there's going to take Netflix out the box, okay? <laughs> like whatever you have, your own natural soaps or hair gel or whatever you have. This will get you the funding and investing you need without breaking a sweat, without the nerves of wondering what they're going to say. OK, now, look, you're going to be in a position where you're so good, you don't even care what they say. But if you just need a little help, then fine. My job is to get you set up to where you don't even need them if you don't want. But if you go there and you just, just, you know, want a little extra, it won't kill you. These people will put their hopes and dreams on going on this show. We don't want you to have to do that. The sharks give budding entrepreneurs the chance to secure business deals that can make them millions. That's a load of crap. You can do that on your damn own. But today I'm going to show you how I'm doing it on my own, but if I wanted to go on this show, guaranteed, just based off of my data and my proof of the three-step formula that I'm giving you, they would give me the money because they'll say, oh, snap. I mean, he's pretty much set up. It's just like a rapper that tries to get a record deal. If you go there, you don't even have your album recorded. You just got one demo song recorded. You never like prove that people even like your music. You haven't performed yet. They're going to rape you. They're going to not give you a good deal or, 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 or they're not going to give you a deal at all. <laughs> they're going to give you a slave deal or something like that because you haven't proven. They're taking a risk on you. The goal for them is not to take a huge risk on you. So the more you have set up on your own, the best chances uh, for you to get approved. OK, so let me show you what I'm doing. All right. So this is my site right here. I own a school. This is F a job trade school It's a school for entrepreneurs, the first of its kind. All right. So soon it will be converted into a university. My goal, which what I, is what I would tell them if I went on there, my goal is to take out Harvard, to take out all of the traditional schools like Harvard, Yale, Cornell, all of those guys. Why? 
because they teach you non-practical ways of living life. Nobody cares about what those subjects is, uh, English literature or science, not any of those things like that. It's not pushing this new age world of technology and services and everything like that. They're teaching the wrong things. First of all, I have the first ever entrepreneurial university where you earn first, then you learn as you go. All right. So when they come to this school, they'll be able to start making money in their field way before they graduate because 90% of people that go to college have to drop out just to get a damn job to take care of their kids if they have them, okay? So we cure that. So everything is literally set up. Have all of the irresistible offers for the um, the people that want to go to school here, basically to get them just, just super comfortable and where it's going to be proven that they're going to have a high retention rate and they're going to finish all the way to the end and they're going to be able to pay tuition because they're going to be making money the first week that they even enroll. Boom. All right. So <laughs> this is awesome. Oh, join over 20,000 successful graduates from over uh, 50 countries that are getting paid to do what they love. This is the first of its kind. OK, but that's fine. Other people have good concepts as well. Let's see if it's working. All right, so if you come over to Google, you can Google college, uh, community colleges in Yuma, Arizona. My school is number three in that entire city, okay? Uh, positioned as a college already, and we're scaling out to many, 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 many cities, okay? So um, St. Louis Culinary School. We are number one right here at the top in the entire city, St. Louis Real Estate School. We are number one and number two in the entire city. So why am I showing you this part right here? Okay, rule number one or step number one. Remember, I told you it's three steps. Step number one is positioning yourself. Okay, the reason why I'm showing you this is because I'm positioning your myself. You want to position yourself as somebody in that industry first, because those sharks. These investors are going to think, I don't know you. I don't know you, but you want some of my money to build your dream. How do I know anybody else cares about your dream? Okay, do you guys understand? This is why these people aren't winning because nobody knows them and nobody cares about what they have. So if they had a first built this out, built their dream out first, did as much as they could possibly do with their own budget, okay? And then spent the rest of their dime positioning their self. Rule number one, position yourself. Make yourself visible. Become a brand. Become well known to where when people search popular things, you pop up and they're like, oh damn, who is that? Okay, and then position yourself uniquely to where you stand out from the competition. You don't want to just be visible. You want to be like, Shh, yeah, there's a lot of people that do that, but they're the only one that does this. Position yourself. Your name should come with the only one that blank. Okay, if you want to know if your company is going to be successful, practice that with your line. Uh, practice that. My company is the only one that does this. My company is the only one known for this. All right. What are you known for? Position yourself, become visible and become known for something in particular that people can't just copy and, and, and just just easily just imitate from some other just random site. OK, so you come to the top, you you be positioned. All right. We're at the top. Accomplished. We're at the top. OK, so that's number one. We position ourselves. See, David proves all things. The Bible says to prove all things. So step number two, make sure you're writing these things down. Comment below, David, I'm writing it down. I'm writing it down, David. You don't have to worry. I'm going to get approved by anybody, any investor that I approach, because I'm writing it down, and I believe I got faith, all right? Faith without works is dead, though, so you got to put in the work. Don't just write it down. Do what I'm telling you, and you can walk with confidence when you approach anybody with your idea or something because you already know it works because it's already working. Okay, so I'm give you actionable steps. All right, so position yourself. So if you want to know how to do things like 
what I'm doing right now. And, and you're like, okay, maybe you're not a marketer. You're watching this because I did put some different tags in the, in the, in the video. So I don't even think it's targeting marketers. It's just targeting people that like the shark tank show or something like that. But if you're not a marketer and you don't know what this is, this is called SEO search engine optimization, the art of being found in the search engines, hopefully at the top, because people will search for these keywords. You have done this yourself. All right. You search in here and the goal is for you to show up at the top. That's what SEO is. All right. In layman's terms. All right. So I can teach you that. Chances are the training is in the description of this video. You might want to check it out. There's going to be a whole bunch of goodies in the description. OK, so you position yourself first using SEO. This is called the snack pack. We call it the Google snack pack because 80 percent of the phone call volume and sales come from this area right here. This is your major goal. Why do you think I take up two spots soon to out, uh, out them totally? I'm going to take that spot as well. Then it'll just be me. All right. Me, 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 Mr. Anderson. OK, now step number two. <sighs> Leveraging others. All right. So step number one was positioning yourself to be a somebody. All right. Make yourself visible. Then see it all ties together. Then you'll be able to leverage others. If you're a nobody, how do you get people on your movement? It's about the movement, people believing in what you do. OK, so take a look. This is called the F job joint venture page. I get people every single day for uh, pretty much every single day when I'm advertising for this to sign up to willingly be a joint venture partner of me so that we can rank and be some of the greatest uh, college uh, education providers in the world. OK, and not just this. We have a whole bunch of different businesses and everything and our joint ventures are able uh our joint venture partners are able to participate in that and make money okay so then none of this would be possible uh me getting joint ventures and everything like that if i didn't first position myself all i have to do is tell them i got the biggest school in st louis and i just want to do this all over the freaking world they go and search they see that i'm not lying they see my school everywhere that's why it's good to be positioned and then they say hell yeah i want to join that party how much can i make helping you out david how much can we make on this dream you understand okay so now you're leveraging others that's number two that's why you want to stay to number three okay so step number one let's recap is positioning yourself you can do that with uh seo ranking in the snack pack you can do that with google ads you can do that with youtube ads you can do it with pinterest ads you can do it with instagram ads and you can do it with facebook ads you can even do it with yelp ads linkedin ads we don't want to stop there amazon ads all right the whole goal is for you to be visible in your industry whatever you're trying to sell you need to start becoming a well-known name or brand or people have seen you around or something they visited your site before watched a video from you you want that to start being the conversation of you then when you do outreach to them they're like oh yeah i heard about you hell yeah i want to partner with you they're excited they're actually searching it out okay so this is the back office of my site right here and this is the joint venture page as you can see we have 331 joint venture partners all right 331 joint venture partners so why would they want to partner with me well i can show them this data look we got 84 people already enrolled in the culinary arts section of the school we got 22 people that's in the seo section of the school and this is just st louis all right we got uh 27 in the cpa marketing uh where are we at 154 came through the the, the new page this is the login okay and then we got a whole bunch of other different pages we have affiliates that actually work for us and then we have our own internship program okay so this is all i have to do 
oh, don't forget the real estate program right here. So I show them this and they're like, snap, I'm down. I, I, want, I want a partner. How much can I make? And when they find out that our culinary arts program is starting at $10,000 or $20,000, I'm sorry, $20,000, and they get half of that per semester, they're like, hell yeah. You know, <laughs> they're like, yes. Anybody that comes through my joint venture partner's uh, uh, property, they get half of that, okay? And they don't even have to do any work. So it's very easy for me to leverage others because I allow them to leverage my knowledge. I allow them to leverage my uh, um, intelligence and my networks and, and everything like that. So it's very easy for me to leverage others. Remember, your net worth is determined by your network. This is why I'm so transparent with you guys, because I have to position myself as not one of those YouTubers that just talk bull crap, but they're not really doing anything. So I show you guys majority of my stuff that I can show that doesn't have non-disclosure agreements. All right. <laughs> all right. So as you can see, the joint venture page has 331 people. All right. OK, so. What is step number three? Step number three is very simple. <sighs> Drum roll, please. Brrr, ting. All you doing for step number three is profiting. That's it. That's it. Step number three is the profit. And you just rinse and repeat in a different location a uh, city or a different platform or wherever you just make it work you get the system and this works with anything you get the system down to where it works for you once or, or one in one area and then you just don't reinvent the wheel every time you go to another area you take that same thing you make it to as templated so easy a blank can do it and then you say you know what i want to do this in kansas city you know what i want to do this in australia okay and it will work there because it's a proven model. How do you think franchises work? How do you think the same Subway or McDonald's in St. Louis can be in China and still be profitable? They got it working to a science to where it's templatable. And then they tell the franchisee, don't change nothing. Do it exactly how I'm doing it right here. And now they can have thousands of stores and locations all over the freaking nation or internationally actual yes i'm right i got perfect but anyway <laughs> you guys understand what i'm saying so that's how you can get one of these losers sorry mark cuban this is how i talk this is how you can get them to invest in you if you want to but like i said if you use the in information in the description of this video i look I'm not supposed to give earnings. Uh, I I give a disclaimer. If you don't use this information, uh, uh, um, and most people that take the information, they don't really do anything. So I can't promise you earnings or any amount of earnings or anything because most people won't even do anything. So use your common sense. You know that if you don't do anything, you can't come back and say, David, your advice didn't work. Did you do all the steps? No. Well, go away. All right. So. Just do everything I teach you and have faith. I'm not, you know what I'm saying? I look, it's going, I'll just say this. How about this? It's going to be damn near impossible for it not to work for you. There, I didn't make any guarantees to you. <laughs> it's going to be, tell your lawyer that. Ha! <laughs> it's going to be damn near impossible for you to get turned down if you come to them. Uh, with everything that I put on your checkoff list, positioning, leveraging others, and profiting. Now, what I mean by that positioning, you become visible. Leveraging others, you got backup. They're going to ask you, uh, has anybody else invested in you? Has anybody else uh, backed up your idea? And that's when you can show them, look at all these people I got on my team. Look at all of these people that said, David, you have a working model. We want to be a part of this. Now they got proof of concept. And then if you're profitable already, if you're doing step one and two, you're already making a profit. So you can say by now, our school has already enrolled, blah, 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 amount of people. 
and we've earned this last year. So with your backup and your investment, we can put this on freaking steroids hyperdrive. Hulk Hogan smash. You understand what I'm talking about, guys, okay? If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe because this is not a fluke that you showed up right here. God wanted you to show up on this channel, all right? New, subscribe so that you're not new anymore, okay? Hit the notification bell so that you don't miss out on anything. I want you to hit the ring, the ding, the ding, dong with the Dr. Dre voice, all right? So hit that notification bell, come back because look, I don't want you to close your eyes and miss a thing in my Aerosmith voice. I want you to know exactly what to do and because I don't want you headed back to work. I don't want you to give up on your entrepreneur dreams. That's the scariest thing ever for you to have something that you believe is going to save your life and change everything. And then you give up and go back to being a slave for somebody else. A sad story. Don't let that be your ending. All right. See you guys in the next one, Lord.